Maldives is a country with 200 inhabited islands, white sand beaches, gin clear waters and of course, overwater bungalows. Maldives is a luxury destination that many of us save up money for. Although it's an undeniable fact that the tropical hotspot doesn't go easy on the pocket. But what if you could explore the paradisical island country on a budget without missing out on any major experience? Already dreaming of a beach vacay? Here are 7 budget hacks that will turn your Maldives dreams into a reality. Even though there is nothing like an off-season for Maldives, the months between May to November are marked as the low season. That's when the island is taken over by heavy downpours, making it one-of-a-kind beauty. Accommodation and flight rates go really low around this time. You may not know, but many resorts and even local island properties give last-minute offers and discounts in the off-season. So be quick and don't miss out on saving big on your Maldives trip. The flight ticket to Mali, the capital of Maldives, has gone really cheap over the years. Many Indian domestic airlines are flying directly to Mali from major metro cities in India. It takes about 3 hours and costs between only Rs 13,000 to Rs 18,000 for a round trip. Book your flights early for saving on the airfare. A smart move is to find your base at any local island such as Mafushi, Guli, Fulidu or Garedu in Maldives. These islands host a wide variety of homestays, guest houses and budget hotels that will cost you around Rs 1700 per night, especially in the off-season. The accommodation will come out to be even cheaper if you're travelling in a group. Though commuting in Maldives is easy, the cost drastically varies from one mode of transport to the other. Though seaplanes, speedboats and yachts definitely offer quite an experience, it can come out to be a bit expensive, especially for budget travellers. Luckily, ferries offer an affordable option. For example, reaching Mali via ferry from the airport will cost you around 40 Maldivian rufia which equals to 198 Indian rupees. It's just that these ferries won't drop you at the islands with luxurious resorts. But hey, here you won't miss out on much because Maldives landscape is equally beautiful wherever you go. In Maldives, local food is way cheaper than in luxurious resorts. So if you eat at a local restaurant or cafe, a meal for two would cost between Rs 1200 to Rs 1400. Else, another option is going for a heavy brunch which will help you save more bucks. You can explore the beautiful city of Mali on foot while enjoying its lifestyle, local markets and the popular tourist attraction Friday Mosque. If you prefer adventure, you can try your hand at the cheapest water sport, kayaking and watch the sun go down into the horizon. If you are staying at a hotel or guest house, you can also choose to go for reef snorkeling excursions which will cost you between 210 to 350 Indian rupees including buffet lunch. Another adventure activity that you can try is swimming in Digura beach which is one of the best beaches in Maldives or in artificial beach which comes with no cost and is the best experience one can have in Maldives. The most important aspect of planning a budget trip is timing it well. You can easily explore the best of Maldives even on a short trip. Remember, money saved is money earned. With these tips, you are ready to take off Maldives off your bucket list without breaking the bank. If you like this video, do let us know in the comments. Share it with a friend who's got Maldives on their bucket list. And don't forget to subscribe to Tripoto for more travel hacks.